Welcome back to another edition of History in Your Own Backyard. I'm Satoli. Today we're in northern Kentucky and we're checking out these two railroad tunnels. Stay tuned and I'll tell you all about it. These two train tunnels in the Ryland Heights area of Kenton County, Kentucky are known as the Grants Bend Railroad Tunnels and they both have an interesting history. The tunnel on the west side now the southbound line, was built between 1851 and 1853. It's 2,150 feet long and was originally lined with stone up to 7 feet in height and then crowned with over a half a million bricks to form the arch. However, it has been relined with concrete, hence the stone and brick are no longer visible. A week after the tunnel was built, a passenger train with almost a thousand people toured the tunnel. In 1908, a train derailed inside of the tunnel, but the line was reopened soon after the accident. The tunnel on the east side, now the northbound line, was built 59 years later in 1912 at a cost of $225,000. Where the southbound tunnel is narrow and straight, the northbound tunnel is wider and has a curve to it. The original tunnel is the oldest major piece of transit infrastructure in the greater Cincinnati area, beating out the Roebling Suspension Bridge by 12 years. The rail line was originally owned by the Covington and Lexington Railroad, which was acquired by the Kentucky Central Railroad, which sold out to the l &N Railroad and is now owned by the CSX Railroad. The tunnels are still used daily, and I was lucky enough to catch north and southbound trains the day I was shooting this video. Thanks for watching another edition of History in Your Own Backyard. And remember, travel slowly and stop often. See you next time. Mm -hmm.